Okay, what's up everybody? Okay, so I'm going to do a quick unboxing to the best of my ability of this uh, speaker that I bought from Walmart today that was shown in the previous video. Um, this is the uh, JBL by Harman. This is the uh, Ex Extreme 3, I think it is. Um, oh yeah, Extreme 3. So I'm not sure what level that is. I think there's another one. It's like a bone box. I didn't see it at Walmart though, so I just got this one. Um, like I said, this is the JBL by Harman Extreme 3. So basically, it's a Bluetooth speaker. Um, it shows a picture of a strap, which that looks kind of annoying. Like, I wouldn't carry mine around like that. That's that's irritating. Anyway, y'all, so yeah, this uh, I got this at Walmart. It was... Um, or, uh, or, uh, I don't remember the exact price it was. It was less than 300 after the price match. Um, originally it was 300, but I got a price match because it was the maker of these actually had the price. I'm assuming that's why they marked it down on Walmart because that's the retail price was cheaper. So anyway, yeah, um, they'd already matched the price. It just wasn't like in the in-store price. So I feel bad for people that actually don't know that these are marked down. And they're paying more at Walmart than the uh, website for this company. Anyway, uh, so oh, it says it has a power bank. That's weird. So anyway, it has 15 hours of play time. Uh, it's IP67 waterproof and dustproof, if that means anything to you. It's a JBL Party Boost. I'm not sure what that means. I guess it's like some connection where you can connect more than one of these together but honestly i feel like this is loud enough to where i wouldn't need uh more than one i mean i'll probably get one these are expensive too so it's not like you actually buy two of these at the same time again they're loud enough oh shit i almost dropped it this is about to be a picking up the floor video anyway so yeah let's go ahead and get this open it's showing a picture of two speakers but i doubt there's two speakers in here that would be kind of over the top um yeah, so let's see here. I'm going to do this. Oh, here's the front of the box if you guys are interested. Um, there goes again, JBL by Harman. Harman Cardman or Cartman or whatever is a really good brand of speaker. One of my friends had one of their speakers and it looked, it was a nice, it had really good sound quality. Um, it looked really expensive. Uh, Bluetooth version 5.1. There's the name again, Extreme 3. This picture is so dramatic. Like, really, who's just going to have water meticulously looking like that? So, this is pretty much everything that's on the box, on the outside, I should say. There's nothing really on the... Oh, yeah. Apparently, apparently it won a design award in 2021. Design award, Red Dot winner, something like that. This is now 2023, so that's kind of irrelevant. Uh, party, party boot wireless links multiple JBL3 speakers together. Relay song feel plus. Uh, okay, anyway. Um, yeah, like I said, I don't really have a need for the two speakers right now. So, let me see if there's anything on the bottom to read. Probably not. Maybe the model year or something. Uh, Harman. Uh,. There's no copyright year on here. Just a bunch, oh, 2021. So these came out in 2021, I'm assuming. Uh, let's ask, hey Google, when did the Harman Extreme 3 speakers come out? Sorry, I don't have any information about that, but I found something related. Do you want to know when was JBL Extreme 3 released? Yes, that's literally what I just asked. Yes. On the website leadrating.com, they say the JBL Extreme 3 retailed for $350 when it was just released last November 2020. But now, in March 2022, you can get the JBL Extreme 3 for $320, which is definitely a good deal for a jumbo speaker. What is this? Yeah, so it was not that price. When I got it. So let's go ahead and open this thing. I'm gonna try to do this one handed so you guys. Message from Babe. 
Message from Babe. Okay, this is not a one-handed job. I'm trying to keep the camera steady and turn this around without dropping anything. It's hard to look, you guys. So I'm sitting in a chair. I didn't really plan on doing this video. I just thought about it at the last minute. I guess we'll go ahead and cut this tape off of here. I might just go ahead and pause this video after I get everything open because this is going to be really awkward. Oh, maybe not. Okay. Might not be the best viewing angle for you guys, but I'm doing the best I can with what I got. Okay, not too bad. Okay, why are people on the beach with sparklers near electronics? What does that have to do with, okay. Again, the marketing is just over the top. Is this part of the box? Okay, it's part of the box. So, that's just one flap of the box, you guys. They are over the top. This is where the money went to <laughs> into their marketing advertising. Because the inside of the box is playing. So yeah, they want to get you guys' attention. My thing is though, you've pretty much got the attention. They've got your attention if you're putting this much money into a speaker. That's not even Hardman Carbon. It's something, something, something by Hardman. So branch off. Whatever. Anyway, so let's see how this works out. Um that's just a well, it's a pretty dense. I thought it was one of those uh, pieces of foam, styrofoam. It's actually not. It's like thicker. Is there anything in here? No. Okay. I'm gonna store this. So you got two of those. Oh, I'm throwing shit at my scooter. My scooter probably calling me all types of bitches right now. Like, wait till your ass get on me tomorrow. I'm gonna throw your ass on the side of the road. <laughs> Let me stop talking bad. For that shit really happened. Yeah, I get fucked up. Okay, so what's this? Looks like some type of instructions. Okay, quick start guide. Right. Uh, product registration, safety instructions. Okay, so we're gonna put that off to the side for right now. I'm gonna put it over here. Again, I apologize. I know this isn't the best angle, preferable angle. Okay, so that's empty. Are you guys like me? Let me know in the comment section. Are you guys like me if you uh, go through every piece of paper and every piece of material in y'all? stuff just to make sure you don't throw nothing away like i would literally open this whole box just to make sure they know like key or something that i missed or threw away like they uh they packed it so i mean I'm pretty sure they want you to be thorough okay nothing in there so this is it right here shoe stick First impression, she stick. Where are those? Oh, those are hooks. Okay, yeah, she's definitely hefty. Hold on. Okay. So let's see if there's anything. Oh, there's still more shit in the box. Okay. Let's just see now that I got the speaker out of the box. What's in here? So this is another piece of. Okay, let's see inside of it. Anyway, so I'm assuming this is some type of power cord. We'll put it off to the side. Again, we're just unboxing, we're not reviewing. Um, so that's just cardboard pieces. Yep. Yep. That did not to make this thing 3D. I'll be thinking something's in here. I feel like I want to reach, oh, reach in there and take something out and like tear it apart because does it come apart? Okay. Okay. So, let's 
So you guys can see there's nothing else in there. Box is empty. So let's go ahead and take this whatever this is off of here. There we go. I had to do two hands for one second. So here she is out of the box. Um, like again, she's bulky, hefty, nice. I would like the little material on the outside. It looks like a the inside of a speaker, like the little metal part. JBL, okay. Um, string three, what is that? Is that a cover? That's a cover, okay. So that's your aux cord, that's your charger, and that's your whatever, USB, I don't know. Um, let's see here. Extreme, JBL Extreme 3 portable Bluetooth speaker. Um, there's the other info, if it matters. Interference, blah, 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 blah. I'm assuming that's their website. B, is that BJ's? BIS, okay, I'm not sure what that is. Um, there's no manufacturing date that I can see. Um, oops, shit. So, yeah. Uh, Harman, Harman International Industries Incorporated. Balboa Boulevard, Northridge. Oh, Northridge, cool. From like, uh, what's that show? Not our Carly. What's the other one? Uh, Victorious. Northridge. I know that's actually replaced until like yesterday. Um, see, model. Why is it in Chinese? That's weird. Battery capacity. I'm interested in this type of stuff, y'all. So forgive me. Uh, battery capacity. Set. Okay, five thousand mega amps whatever it's supposed to be so it has a pretty long battery life i think it has 15 15 hour battery life so that's good um i shouldn't i tend to go for um battery lens with that capacity so i'm going to get the instructions and maybe power it on just for shits and giggles and i will be right back with you guys so that's the other side um, does they have feet? Or non-sleep? I guess that's the feet. I don't know. So yeah, I'll be back. Okay, you guys. Oh, what a upgraded? Yeah, I need one of these ones. These are good. Where I get that from? I think I got it from like it was like a you know dollar store. It was somewhere. I forget like a random quirky store. Yeah, an extra one. I need one. I have to dig through my little things and find out. Um, well, I send you guys. So I'm back, you guys. So I'm gonna turn it on just to kind of show you what it looks like when it's on. I'm not gonna charge it now because I want to see how long it lasts before it dies. So let's go ahead and turn her on. Okay, I guess I don't. I gotta hold the button. Wait. What is it doing? I missed it. I mean, I missed. Still, it's still searching for pictures. I mean, I guess I'm saying I'm used to Raycon. Like Raycon sings to you, then it, you know what I'm saying. I'm used to that. Like this one just kind of said, I don't know if I had to, I had to hold it down. I think I held it down. Um, it, the Bluetooth is flashing, so it's on top. Oh, okay, there it is. <laughs> now it's not flashing, so it's not, it's not trying to search, but with it now it's flashing. It's searching. Okay, so as you guys can see, that's the this thing actually has a battery meter. I found that out in the instructions. So it's not like just you know your typical like red light that stays on or blue light or whatever. So that's actually a nice feature. Um, that's obviously the why is this thing going out of focus? That actually that's the uh, icon for Bluetooth. That's the power button. Um, these is this is your like multi-link button basically. I don't have more than one speaker, so that's kind of irrelevant right now. You got your minus button, your volume button, whatever. And obviously, if you push it more than one time, it'll uh, I don't know, it'll uh, you know, do like the skipping and pausing or whatever you want to call it. I feel like this video is out of focus. Can you guys see that? Let me know in the comments if the video gets blurry. Hmm. 
the camera, like hold it still and press it. And then it should focus. I think she's smudgy. I'm really OCD about this type of stuff. Anyway, um, so that's, like I said, and this is, I think, the play button or whatever. Um, I'm going to really enjoy this in the summertime, like when it gets warm again, so I can actually take this out and neck on my bike or whatever. I probably won't put it on my scooter because there's nowhere to put it at. Um, yeah, so, like my little GPS, open-faced car. But yeah, this is, like I said, this has been the JBL unboxing for the, uh, I think it's the Extreme 3 it's called. So I'm not going to play any music right now because for one, I don't want to get copyrighted. And number two, I'm using my phone. So um, I'll let you guys know in future videos, you know, if I can remember how it sounds, which I'm pretty sure I'm going to be ecstatic. Because like I said, this was, they had a display in Walmart and immediately I've been pushing that button for years. Like I was one of those kids. <laughs> so yeah, I've been definitely anxious for these types of speakers um so i finally got it so like i said thank you guys for watching my video this has been my jbl um extreme 3 unboxing video so hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know if you guys have seen this thing before if you had it before all those good things and i will talk to you guys in my next video also be sure to watch my uh, previous video it's my sam's club and walmart hall so you'll see this in the video so, thank you guys for watching. I will talk to you in my next video. Peace out. I'm trying to let this thing roll. It feels real rolly, so I'm trying to keep it, like, steady. Peace out, you guys.